small village of right around the corner. Max and Uncle Pong, the great inventor, are sitting in the garden. Uncle Pong has just told a really scary ghost story. I'd like to do something exciting too. Ah, oh, Max, the world is full of adventures and secrets. You just have to look for them. What's wrong with your lawnmower? Hmm, engine trouble. Hmm, I just can't find the fault. Time to go to bed. Night, night, Mummy. Night, night, Teddy. Night, night, Doggy. Night, night, Toothbrush. Night, night, pajamas. Night, night, lamp. Good night, my girl. Good night. Good night. Good night. Summer evening is fabulous. Thank you, Bottle. You're welcome, Max. Getting fatter and fatter. Hey, Clara, back from the haunted castle. Oh, she's really worked up. Hello, Uncle Punk. Hello, Max. We need your help. Willy, the little castle ghost, can't fly through the walls and doors anymore. What? Do you mean to say that Willie has lost his ghost power? Yes. This always happens when ghosts get hungry. And Willie's incredibly hungry. What do ghosts like to eat then? Oh, that depends. Willie, for example, only eats small yellow socks with lots of holes in them. Yellow socks? With holes? Exactly. It's really quite simple. There are small yellow socks all over the place in the castle. Willie would look for them himself if he could only get out of the tower room. The door has been locked for hundreds of years. Now you must come and find the socks. Willie needs exactly 12 yellow socks if he's to get his ghost power back. Please come to the castle as quickly as you can. I'll be waiting for you. Uncle Pong, we have to help 
Oh, Willie. Um, uh, Max, I, I think um, I, I must invent the uh, sweetie making uh, machine, uh, and uh, um, I think it will be an excellent chance for you to have a, a little adventure. Oh, what do you think? I should go to the castle alone. Uh, of course, it'll be great. A castle full of uh, ghosts. That's just the right thing for uh, you. Should Max go to the castle? Yes. No. Yes. As Max arrives at the castle garden, he seems to have lost most of his courage. But the mere thought of poor Willie expels his fears. It's not every day that one has the chance to collect yellow socks for hungry ghosts. Famous old castle, Muse Swinstein. <laughs> Max can enter the castle here. Do you want him to? Yes. entrance hall. Actually, it looks quite cozy. Max is determined not to be afraid. Hello, Max! Don't, Don't be afraid! We'll help you! Huh? Who are you, then? I am Fabian of New Schweinstein. 358 years of age. I am Magdalena of New Swinestein, and just 297 years young. Well, I'm Gustav of New Swinestein, 502 years old. <laughs> oh, that's okay. I think it is very nice of you to help me out. Oh, it's nothing really. No problem. Oh, it's a pleasure. Hello, there you are, you old poltergeist. Hello, woolly helmet. Yahoo! I found the first yellow sock. Oh wow! Max has found the yellow sock. As yellow as lemon juice. Are you a, a castle ghost? Very right you are. I am the dreaded Countess Grusella Gruesome. You are little Max, I suppose. And you wish to find the socks for the little ghost, Billy? <laughs> I'll scare you wherever you are. That would be a wonderful thing to do. <laughs> Little eye, something.
thing and it's brown. The shoes? Okay, you win. My spy with my little eye. Something that looks like a cow. I know, I know. It's Max. Right, that's correct. Like a cow? How did you work that one out? <laughs> <laughs> through the castle, the ghosts keep themselves warm in front of the crackling fire. Last count of New Schweinstein expelled. Bodo von Schweinstein refused to comment on his abrupt departure. Informed circles have disclosed the fact that ghostly howling regularly denied him a night's sleep. has found a secret corridor. So he has. What do you say to that? The good old secret corridor. I'd completely forgotten about that. Oh, wow. Do I really have to crawl inside there now? Crawl into the fireplace? Yes? No? Yes! This is the library of New Swinstein Castle. The ghosts read the multitude of books all night long. I wonder if there are any socks hidden here. So, my little Max, this was not what we agreed. 
<laughs> this is absolutely no fun at all. <laughs> night don't be afraid max he's just a show off um, once again mr pong is very close to a sensational invention at the present he declines to disclose any details Would you like to go through this door with Max? Yes? No? Yes! Ah, a terrace. Max can see the small village of right around the corner in the far distance. There is light in one of the windows. I'm sure that's Uncle Pong, working on his invention. Have you heard this one? Yeah, definitely. Oh no, not that again. Ooh, oh, I'm so tired. Willie to come back and tell us stories again. Oh, yes! Mm, when is Willie coming back? Good old Willie. Cellar. And all this weird junk everywhere. I bet the ghosts could do with all this. Dinner is served. Dinner is served. Okay. 
is. Not for Willy, I'm afraid. That's our fright machine. And the talk of it for us. Isn't it wonderfully practical? Hello, Punch. Did you see the crocodile? No. No, but Punch, look out! Behind you! The crocodile! Watch out! Yippee, a yellow sock! Fabulous, Max! You found a yellow sock! Now there are only seven yellow socks missing. Should Max go back upstairs into the kitchen again? Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. Yes. This is the pantry. Max has never seen such a huge oven. I wonder what they cook here. Wow! A real haunted kitchen! The secret door to the cellar. Oh, the door actually looks like a cupboard. My word, Gustav. That's why it's called a secret door. Oh, yes, of course. It wouldn't be a secret otherwise. <laughs> I understand. Do you dare to go into the cellar with Max? Yes? No. No. Who are you? Never heard of Father Time. Oh no, not him again. With lemon curd. For dessert, we had pie in the sky. Ooh. <laughs> I've got three wishes. You? Why you? Oh, silly me. <laughs> I'm all getting everything topsy-turvy. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. Do you know Willie's favorite meal? Ingredients are one well hung and washed yellow sock. A good sock is ripe to eat when it has enough holes in it. The sock should be then fried in a pan at a low heat until it steams up. Then it should be turned over carefully and served on a piece of toast. <laughs> well, you can of course stuff the sock if you prefer. Hmm. I don't like it very much myself. 
but little Willie can't get enough of it. Just pour hot water over it. Leave it for 12 minutes and bon appetit. Red, light your nose in winter. No, red isn't the right color. Yellow as a sunflower. Willy will love the taste of that one. Hooray! A sock with loads of holes in it! Now there are only six yellow socks missing. He's discovered the dumb waiter. Do you think it still works? Yeah, of course. That stupid old creep still uses it. Oh boy, I don't know whether I should go in there or not. See, Max, you're really scared, aren't you? <laughs> Food is transported in castles and dumb waiters such as this one. Should Max travel with the dumb waiter? Yes? No. Yes! Ghosts of New Schweinstein are having their supper. When a ghost is old and experienced, it has to be especially bad mannered. That's the spirit's code of honor. in the haunted castle. Unfortunately, I haven't quite finished my sweetie making machine yet. Only small red buttons keep coming out of it. I need one more bright idea. I hope that everything is all right. You're always in my thoughts. Your Uncle Pom. Uh-oh, red buttons. I doubt whether that will work.
scared? No, no, that's just a shadow. You can't frighten me, Mrs. Gruesome. Ha! Just listen to that little Max. Nothing seems to frighten him. How nice. Max has discovered the singing carpet. Please play us a lovely spooky song. Spooky. What a pity! This one's no good. It's as green as a cucumber. Oh no! Green socks! Willy doesn't like them! found a sock and it has the right colour too. Yellow, as yellow as a lemon. Great, a yellow sock. Now there are only five yellow socks missing. to go on the ghost train with Max? Yes? No. 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 Yes. No. Yes. Ghosts are splashing around with cold water in the bathroom. If we can't get rid of a stain in this way, there is always the washing machine. as soon as I 
I can. And yes, I'd love to be able to fly around. Okay, I'll tell him. Lots of luck, Max. You can do it. Soon be too fat to fly. Enter this door? Yes? No? Yes! How does a ghost become a good ghost? It's hard work. They learn all the tricks how to scare humans in the ghost school. Diet is normally laid down according to the age of the ghost. Very young spirits like small yellow socks. Whilst the somewhat older ghosts prefer striped underwear. The ancient experienced ghosts seem to have developed a liking for checked pullovers. just cannot go on like this any longer. The humans are no longer scared of us. Where will this lead us? We have to practice, practice, practice. to be able to go through walls, too. Me, too. We have to hang around here in these frames. <laughs> and, and that for hundreds of years, too. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Texas found, found a yellow, yellow sock as yellow as the moon. Hooray, yellow sock! Now there are only three yellow socks missing. to enter this door? Yes? No? Yes! There's a beautiful four-poster bed in the bedroom. Is that just a quilt? Or is a ghost sleeping there? Max wonders whether ghosts can have dreams. So, little Max, time for a guessing game. Which ancestor was known as Princess Big Mouth? was known as Princess Lardpot. <laughs> no, that's not right. You were lucky. Which ancestor was known as Duke Chillis? Well done. Which ancestor was known as Countess Trembleleaf? Which ancestor was known as Prince Wildhair? Well done! Which ancestor was known as Baron Novel? Man, that's right! Take a shower sometime. Oh, I'd love to, but how? <sighs> Are you asleep? <sighs> Shouldn't a 
Felix go out again? Uh, yes. No. Y yes. It goes back downstairs here. Should Max go down these stairs? Yes. No. Yes. The castle is full of nooks and crannies. Here on the first floor are many passages, doors and stairwells. Max is not quite sure where to begin his search for the socks. Mm, I'm hungry too. How come? You had something to eat just 502 years ago. <laughs> Gustav can never get enough.
Oh yes, and when I've got all my ghostly power back, we can play together. That'll be nice! Bye bye Willy! Bye! A sock! There's a sock hidden behind that stone! for Max. Possible, but um, first of all, I have to repair the lawn mower. Ah, Max, I, I'm so proud of you. It wasn't easy, and sometimes it was really scary. Yes, yes, that pleases me. Although I have to admit that I have never met such a courageous little boy before.